About two weeks ago, I said to go ahead and submit y'all baddest sitches so I could get them to work at Benadrillia's club, and you guys did not disappoint. But I chose my final five, so without further ado, allow me to introduce them. Alright guys, this video gets a little bit wild, especially towards the end, so if you're new here, brace yourself, but if you've been here before, this is nothing new, <laughs> and if you like the video, give me my thumbs up, don't be stingy now. You guys, we are back with the main baddie B, and a brand new fit and all, we're back with the mustiest dog known to man, we're back with the, well I guess, yeah, the club isn't as dirty as it was last episode. If you saw in the opening clip, we did in fact have mold, but don't worry, Vanessa came in and she cleaned it right up. Look, Max ain't phased, Max is big chilling, um, there's some throw up spots i think dusty might have to go to the vet we still got custody of these people in the back um they're still alive i don't know how but the most important thing of all is the fact that it is our first day for our new hires in the club and let me just say they are doing the damn thing we definitely gotta like turn up today girl open this bodega up open it up and before i forget y'all we officially have a name for the club welcome to benny's booty bodega yeah yeah thank you sixth street for dropping this fire ass name everybody was rocking with that name i mean like when i posted the poll it won by a landslide everybody was rocking with it you ate that little one thing and i forgot to mention don did in fact get demoted to janitor because um we needed to make space for the dancers he's right next to rylan rest in peace rest in peace rylan um i'm now realizing my toilet is mad small I'm gonna keep it that way, you know, I'm gonna keep it that way. It's kind of like chic, like petite. And since it's so small, it's helping us maximize the usage of space in this catress room. Like, come on, tap in. We got my good sister Adderall Isha on the bar right now. Like, when I'm telling y'all, I'm pretty sure this is Benny's long lost cousin. Oh, she must not agree. I think so. Y'all tap into the new fit. I had to elevate our look for the one time. We make too much money to look broke. With the way we set up right now, it's kind of giving like Benadrillia's cabaret. Is that my good sister? Mary, oh my gosh, every time I see this bitch, every time I see this bitch, oh, we literally need to give her like a tip or something. She's a huge, well, a minor part of the reason why this place is what it is. She's the it girl. Well, no, that's us, but she's something. Also, it's finally Winterfest, and I'm gonna make sure we partake in these activities. We gotta be Holly and Jolly, open some presents, make a grand meal. Actually, let's make a grand meal right now. We'll make it in honor of Rylan. In honor of Rylan, what would Rylan wanna eat? Rylan wouldn't want to eat none of this shit. What are these options? <laughs> I guess we can do a turkey dinner. Like, I was more so thinking like a big ass seafood boil. But if anything, they can get food from the bodega too. I low key been thinking about decorating it though, you know, spicing it up. Wait, why isn't she cooking? Oh, it's because of Rylan's urn. Okay, where can I put this? Can I put it like on top of the fridge? On top of the trash can? On top of the stove? Like, I don't know, just anywhere. Just make my damn turkey dinner. Actually, we gonna put them on the corner of the stove because like it's one thing to die in this room, but to like accidentally set your ashes on fire, like in his room specifically, this is his room now. He owns this place. We can't do that. It's mad sad he went out like that though. Like we really could have probably prevented that. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, girl. <laughs> Girl, not like this. We promised we'd be a sanitary club. Y'all ignore that for real. She's just getting into cooking. Also, peep how we still got the same bag even though we elevated. We is a humble queen, even if our bag is as stiff as a chip bag. Don't play with us, for real. We might have to take Dusty to the vet, cause scrub the spores off. Is that mold? Does that mean he has mold? Okay. Dusty, what's going on? Cooking is delectable. Flip those flapjacks, toss that sauce. Benadrillia is in her element. Does she want to gobble up this opportunity to embrace the fact that she likes cooking? Well, yes. My good sis knows her way around pots and pans, but it wasn't because she was cooking up food. I can tell you that. They keep talking about my drinks too expensive. Like, it's not my fault you're poor. Like, look at us, y'all. Look at this fit. Do you think a bitch dressed like this is gonna touch or help poor people? All right, with the funds we do have, I really do wanna like decorate the bodega a little bit, like spice it up, add a little one too. First thing I'm gonna get is an M1911. Cause after last episode, y'all, I made aware that the crime rates in this area have skyrocketed. Gonna put that right in the forefront. 
Now, nobody can say they didn't know what type of timing we was on now. I want to add this music poster somewhere. Yes, Deftones. Got the Deftones poster and the M1911 on the table. Ain't nobody touching this club. Don't be afraid to use that gun now, Mary. We got connections. We get you out of jail. Now, when you shoot this gun, girl, don't blow your back out. Because I always bring it up. But with the way your back was cracking the first episode, you got to be careful. Where is Dusty at? Oh, my gosh. I really think Dusty has mold on him. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Scrub the spores off. Uh, Benadrilia, let's give him a bath real quick because I don't need these customers calling animal control or some shit, not today. Hey, y'all, don't judge me too hard because I really don't even know how he got mold on him for real. Like, he just be getting into shit. Like, I can't keep up with him. So we just have to give him a bath, which Penny tried to do last episode, but her ass smelled so bad she had to keep reusing the bathtub over and over to the point where Dusty couldn't even get his appointment in. But all this really is Dusty's fault because Max, oh, Max kind of stink too. You know what else stinks? This bar, like Adoralisha, why is this bar so dirty? And this drink right here got a stench or fume coming from it. Girl, now she want to act like she's just now noticing it. Girl, it is very much so dead ass in your face. Um, where is my good sis Mary at? The scary ass bitch. She needs to be like exterminated. I will still never understand why she's selling cricket meal and popcorn crickets. Did I not see that the first time? What the hell is a popcorn cricket? Let me just grab this hot cocoa and call it a day. Like, I'm not going to ask questions. <gasps> it's snowing! Wow, on Winterfest 2, this is the best day ever. But what about the people in the back? Are they going to freeze? They be alright. Y'all, Rylan's death really shook Benadrilia up. Like, she's just been really, really sad ever since his passing. But how can you be sad when Mother Melinda's f***ing it up like this? I'm just trying to figure out how her knees are not giving out right now. Throwing it in rotation to the rhythm of the trumpets on these hoes. I know that's right. Alright, she's finally cleaning the bar. After how long? After it's gotten to what state? Like, I don't know, y'all. I'm not really feeling out of Alicia all that much. Okay, what else do we have to do for Winterfest? To participate, open a present from any gift pile. Okay, let's get a gift pile real quick. Oh, this is a gift pile? I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure we have like two of these. Bethany right next to one of them. She over here whining for Winterfest. <laughs> y'all, why I'm excited what we get? Oh, damn. Who would give one carrot as a gift? Who would? One carrot? Do we look like Bugs Bunny, bitch? Who the fuck? That's a weak ass gift. Yeah, girl, just vape to that. Vape to that to ease the stress. Like, uh, it's already been so hard. We've been so depressed and they want to give us a bad present like that. Who the fuck? Girl, let's just go upstairs and cry. Like, let's just go upstairs and cry. It's like Meg the Stallion said, bad bitches have bad days too. And this is the worst day of my life. <laughs> Penny, get the fuck off my phone, bitch. This is not the time. <laughs> I know, girl. <laughs> I miss him, too. <laughs> what good is my life if Rylan ain't in it? Ooh, okay. Adoralisha leveled up in her mixology skill, as she should. You know what? Excuse me real quick. I'm gonna just take a quick step outside. I just, I didn't expect that. I think I prefer this town when it's not snowing. I feel like it looks better. It's just so cold, and on top of that, it's a slow day at the club, like... Look, even Blossom is headed out. She said, it's too cold for this shit. I'm out of here. Okay, I forgot to mention it earlier, but I think that this is the episode where we make renovations to the club because we have, like, some funds that we've been saving up, and I just really need more space. Like, I just want to add a room to the side of the house right here and just, like, make the club look better overall, you know? Oh, she's getting thirsty. And not for attention this time, not for attention. Like she actually has thirst that needs to be quenched. Um, who is this? He looked like a good candidate to me. Oh, you good, bro, bro. You good. <laughs> he didn't even like take step in any direction before falling. I don't even know if I want to get a drink from him anymore. Like I feel bad. That sicker just broke his back for real. Oh, it's getting so serious right now. Yes, Benadrilia, reel him in. I hope he doesn't pass out like in the snow because can't they like freeze to death in The Sims 4? Why my reputation go down? Oh, y'all not rocking with this? What happened to inclusivity? Y'all don't f with an emo vampire bitch? Okay. Hose is mad because we pretty and we rich and we got BBL like bitch. I don't know. Oh, and he's about to pass out. Oh, please don't die. I do not want to be responsible. You know what? I'm going to have her stay in her dark form because it's just like... 
top tier bad bitch like her BBL gets BBLer. She looked good. And I saw the comments where somebody says she got coffee bean lips. When I find you, trust, you will be dealt with. Blossom ended up coming back. I told her I would buy her a heater if she did. I was lying. Truth is, I just didn't want to put Mary in these conditions, you know? What was that? Judith? Judith, do you want to get slapped? Because why did you just kick over my trash can? Kick over my trash can and then, oh, you taking a bath in my bathtub with soaks. I see that as you want to fight. Get out the bathtub, hoe. Let me get my ones in real quick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, get her, Benny. Knock her jaw loose because she don't know how to act. Being a five-star celebrity can't save you now, bitch. Now you're messing with Big Benny. Waka like a dog. Like Saucy Santana would say, where is Santana? He would be living for this right now. Right. Let her know. Don't play with Big Benny. Oh, girl, do you know how dumb that just made me look? Why did you just give this bitch a hug? Okay, whatever. Just open the present. Hopefully somebody got us something better than a carrot. A tablet! Oh, y'all know where this is going. Simba! Sell for 1,000. Uh, shout out Winterfest. Big bands. Not the little one. I want to thank my cousin, Adoralisha. Where is Father Winter at? So apparently he appears near fireplaces, which we do not have, but we can get. Does this count? A radiator? Does this count? Can I use this? Somebody let me know. We'll just get this one to be safe. And then we can put it right here. Oh, girl. Melinda, I'll probably move because this shit might just make your underwear catch flames or something. I hope that Father Winter still pulls through because it said he comes around 8 p.m. and it's 9 but I need him to spread some Christmas joy. And if he does, I don't know shit. Like, I might have to give him a special dance. These damn dogs are raiding my club and getting in the way. And I'm about to call animal control and get them all snatched up. Oh, girl. Judith? This is not a game you want to play right now, girl. This is not. It's so crowded, I can't even focus on here. And that's why I want to expand this place. We're actually just going to move the fireplace over here. It should have been here to begin with. Girl, light the fireplace. <gasps> <gasps> Y'all, I almost just exploded on my chair right now. Father Winter, I'm your biggest, biggest fan, bruh, bruh. Like, I've been waiting for you to come all night. Father Winter, what you up to on this big winter fest? Not the little one. Can we flirt with him? Oh, he's just putting the presents everywhere. Siga, I'm about to have a present waiting for you on the cot upstairs. Girl, what he call me? I know Max is not begging this man for gifts right now. Father went to ignore this dog. Okay, so far we've made $2,000 today. And I think that since it's Winterfest, we should honestly close early because most businesses do that. And plus, I really want to go out tonight. Bitch, I'm trying to go out tonight. And also, I want to take the new hires out because we got to celebrate their first day here at the club, you know? But I feel like it was still a successful day. Um, Man, it must have been a hard one if Bethany is smoking out here. Smoking and sweating? How are you sweating and it's so cold outside? Girl, you stress for real. Benadrilia, let's get drinks for everybody. I don't know where the bartender is at, but if he doesn't show up soon, I'm gonna get to being a pyromaniac. Oh, there he go. Perfect timing. <gasps> Adoralisha. We've been here for less than three minutes, girl. Have some self-control. She just ready to get the night started is all. You know what? I think we're going to splurge a little bit and get the most expensive drinks for the new hires. Oh, never mind. I take it back. Um, Y'all want some apple wine? Well, let's sip on some apple wine. <laughs> we still going to pay for everything, though. But um, if y'all could just cash at me a tip. Oh. All right. Oh. Are y'all seeing this? They are all up on each other right now. Oh, my goodness. Adoralisha cannot keep her hands off the saucy Santaners. Anyway, um, Penny, do you think it's the best idea to be drinking if- Hey. Okay, girl. I was just trying to help a sister out. What is going on over here? Uh, we actually did really good with Winterfest. We celebrated every single one of the traditions. I want Benadrilia to try this. I don't think she's ever done it before. First time trying. Blind reaction. Taste test. Ooh. Oh, oh my goodness, she just broke her arm. Was it that bad? Oh, and she put it right up. Okay, y'all, she didn't like it for real. Our winter fest was amazing, girl, I know. Can somebody tell me why Audrina brought binoculars to the club to scope out Mother Melinda? And here's the gag. She is right here. Like, Audrina can see her up close. Why is Adoralisha outside right now? Like, girl, what did you bump? I want to actually come outside and catch up with her. Like, it's been too, too long. Like since rehab i think it's been a minute i'm telling y'all like they look so similar like look at adoralisha with her little no tail ponytail Ooh, let's tell her to hook up with someone question is who 
Um, why does she not like Saucy Santana? That's not what it was given seven minutes ago. Um, we should do Dina. Let's do Dina. Oh, this must be why she don't like Santana no more. Cause he's messing with Audrina now, Santana's. Put the drinks down, see you about to pee on yourself. PC girl is what is about to be given. Dina sound like a catch. I'll introduce myself when I see her. Okay, let's go find her then. Adoralee should pick up the pace. You wouldn't be cold if you had a coat on your back. Where's Dina? Shuna. Now you know that is not what I said. What is she doing? Why are you just breathing down her neck like that while she makes your drink? Like, bro, what's going on? Oh, this man is getting down. Hey, hit that shit, cut. They playing his shit tonight. I know that's right. Anyway, where are man's at? Hi, Caleb. We ain't talked to you all night for real. You know what? Go ahead and make a move with Caleb. Yeah, do it. She a little bit tipsy, so, you know, this feel like the right time. Who is this? Can you move, bro? Like, dancing all up in my face. You see me talking to my man. Adoralisha is still harassing this bartender, bro. Like, give her some space. At least she got her drink this time. But I don't think she likes it. But let's be honest. If you were breathing down my neck the same way you were breathing down hers, I would be rushing to finish the drink too. Anyway, we back from the club. Um, Everybody's chilling. Oh my gosh, are these girls doing a push-up competition? Adoralisha brought home her nasty drink from the club. <laughs> Y'all, tell me why this club called Singles Meetup have been blowing up Benadrillia's line, talking about we'd love to have you join it. First of all, we in a happy situation ship. Secondly, yes, I'd love to join. Pull up on me right now. Um, also, Kim is in the group, the girl that we beat up three times. I don't even got no beef with Kim no more. You know, like that's old news. All my beef is with the bitch that likes to kick over my trash can. Y'all. I think this is like a swingers group. We do not do that. <laughs> we don't do that. Like, that's not. Oh, girl, back off me. I will call Caleb up right now. Only person I'm trying to dabble with is Vlad. And I don't even know if he's going to say yes. But she, let's find out. If we end up accidentally having a baby by Vlad, though, I'm going to be upset. Is he down, though? Oh, he's down. <laughs> he teleported to the bed. He is down. Maybe he might want to be Benny's boyfriend. Yeah, y'all, this club is not what I thought it was. I thought we was all <laughs> gonna get to mingling with other people, not just passing each other around. I'm having Benadrillia take this pregnancy test because, bitch, I'll be damned. Okay, good, because, y'all, I was scared. I was like, that baby is not gonna be cute at all. All right, now that Winterfest is over, we can officially get rid of all these holiday decorations, which I'm so glad to get rid of because this place just felt so cluttered. But what I think I'm gonna do, since I'm already at it, is just renovate this entire club and then I'll just bounce back whenever I finish. All right, y'all remember how rich I got in this episode? I'm gonna tell y'all right now, all of that money is gone. I'm gonna just be so very honest, but let me show you what it went towards. Look at this space, y'all. No more Katress room, we upgraded the room, and it looks so good now, like, oh. But you guys, it doesn't stop here. Remember our bedroom with the cot in it? Look at it. Oh, wait, hold on, look. We got closets and we replaced the thing from the dumpster. Um, remember our club? Yeah. Yeah, bitch, we elevated. However, I will say we are in fact broke. We have no money now. But I feel like a good way to make all that money back is letting the club run for another day, especially since not too much happened earlier in the episode. And we gonna run this club today with the spirit of Penny Pizzazz. Ugh, I miss her so bad, but she gotta take care of her baby. She can't work here right now. Also, I wanted to provide some more activities for the customer, so I got a ping pong table, a basketball hoop, and a dumpster on these hoes. Okay, Audrina. Had to bust out the vocals for the one time. Listen, she's trying to get Saucy Santana to put a word into his record label so they can scout her out. Don't play with her, she get into the bag. Hey, Benadrillia, you're so notorious that one of my unscrupulous friends has been asking to meet you. Can I give them your number? Well, yes. She's dead ass asking a bitch that's in a relationship while still being in the singles meetup club. Like, yes, girl, we will take that number. Opportunities are everywhere. These new hires are lucky that they weren't here from the jump. Like this club used to be so ugly for real, but we really transformed it. We really did. It looks so good now. Hopefully now that we have more space, it won't feel as cramped. But um, I think we're also going to close at 11 p.m. again today just because we already ran through an entire club day earlier. Um, Why are these people making their way into my room? Climbing in my bed? I haven't even broke my bed in yet. Whoa! I haven't even broke my bed in yet. And they really breaking it in right now. I am so sick. I gotta change my sheets. 
And not Santana joining in, y'all, please. Uh, I'm glad our club is starting to look a little bit more official. Now, yes, it does still look like a house, but y'all, we're not supposed to be running a club out of here. That's why. Wait. Hold on. Because I know that's not who I think it is. Blossom. Did this bitch open a food mart to compete with the bodega? Girl, don't get slapped on a grand reopening day. Please do not piss me off. All right, I need everyone to come in here and take a shot of something. These two over here look like a bad bitch duo. Okay, purr, they look good. All right, we're getting ready to break into the new day, the grand reopening of the club. Everyone needs to grab a drink right now. Hold on, cause my sister Mary over here needs a drink too. She is not gonna forget my good sis at the Bobo. We gotta get Mary lit for the reopening. All right, she's asking my good sis like, what you want a shot of Mary? We got Douce Hennessy, or if you want like Smirnoff Pink Lemonade, something light. We not gonna fire you for drinking on the job. We genuinely offering. All right, period, we are open. They getting right to work. I love this stage. It just feels so much more official. Like this club is eating. It's coming together, y'all. It's coming together. We gotta change out of this dark form. Girl, we gotta go like business mode right now. Friend, I did not say ho mode. I said business mode, Benadrillia. I ain't give you this hot pink blazer for nothing, bitch. You gonna put it on. Oh my goodness. Oh, what is that? Y'all. Oh my god. Ain't no way. Y'all, if I'm being so honest, I be forgetting Greg works here. Like, and I feel so bad because he's an OG, but I love that man. That's my dog. Y'all, what if I said that I wanted Benadrillia to get pregnant this episode? And I'm so serious. She calling Caleb right now. Okay, he's here. I'm thinking we bombard him with romance until he's ready to have a child with Benadrillia. And listen, we're not trying to have this baby because we love this man or nothing. Like, it's it was never given that. I just want her to have a kid. <laughs> like, honestly, he can be as involved as he wants if he even wants to be involved. Oh, all right now. All right now, pipe down. We ain't got to do this in front of everybody. Oh, he tweaking. Girl, when I tell you this man is so emotionally unstable, like, he be yelling one second and kissing on Benadrillia the next. And, and see, this is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. Mind you, this is the same man that was taking Benadrillia on Jetpack Joyride. I'm about to dump him. Oh, girl. Oh, she posted up. Oh, she loved the atmosphere of this club. She is rocking with it. Dawn, where is your uniform at? And you're not doing your job. You are not a client. You can move. Like, what's the point of even having a janitor if I have to do everything? It's pointless, is what I'm saying. And there Caleb go. You know what? I'm about to break up with him like y'all. I'm through. And these customers don't be cleaning up after themselves neither. Like, oh, drink this one. Hey, that's a free drink. Hey, big drink, big drink. Oh, she wants to make an enemy. All right, let's go make an enemy then. Shit, I'm down for that. Let's go. Who we gonna fight? Girl, please, why are you bringing a horn to the club? Anyways, um, I don't know. Maybe Adderall Alicia, cause like, if I'm being honest, I feel like she got dark sided energy. Like y'all hear her, she's growling at me. Damn near foaming at the mouth. Weird ass. Wait, scratch that. We ain't fighting Adderall Alicia. Judith is right here. And she's an eligible candidate, I'll tell you that. All right, hold on. Turn this way a little bit. Yeah, there we go. I'm taking a picture of the both of us before she get her ass beat. It's like a before picture. Click. Paulo said, hey, Benadrillia, I heard a lot about you. Mostly bad things, but that's okay. People usually don't like me either. We should hang out sometime. <gasps> I was just saying we needed a new man. Like, wait, hold on. We don't even like him. Damn, we don't even like him. I'm sorry, Paulo. Oh, I need this picture big. Yeah, everybody need to see this. I need everybody to know what this five-star celeb looked like before she got dragged by a five-star sitch. Yeah, go ahead and take your pictures with your little fans. They probably don't even know who you are. Whole time you saying you famous and they think you Barbara from Shark Tank. Ooh, y'all, she just whipped out the vampire form. Oh! She uses superpowers! All right, Benny. Get your one, sis. Get your one. Damn! She fighting hard as fuck. I think she got a hold of the Hennessy. Somebody sensed the gram this. She gonna be known as the bitch that beat Judith Ward's ass. Oh, not we lost. Y'all, I'm so embarrassed, like. And I'm here shouting, since the gram this, post that. None of y'all bitches better pull out your phone. I'm fed up, like. I'm about to intervene right now. Forgive me after this. Put it in a head like Benadrillia. We just gotta choke this bitch. Like, we just lost two fights in front of everyone. 
Yeah, I didn't even want to have to do that for real. Like, I really did it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hold on, just adjust this real quick. Uh-huh. Yeah, that look good. Click. Oh, girl. Oh, don't piss me off. Not right now. Why is there a gnome on all of these pictures? Like, bruh. Can we get a single win today? Like, I feel like Ben and Julia put a gnome on these pictures to cover that nose of hers. She just ruined the plan for real. Hold on. Let me celebrate and eat this carrot real quick. You know what? Maybe it did come in handy. I do feel a little bit better now. I do. I admit it. <laughs> Y'all, I keep hearing somebody howling. Can you please? Okay, we just got to punch him because these furries is getting out of hand. All right, girl, he was right in front of you. Like, girl, run away. See, and that's what you get because I just told you to get to running and you stood still. This is a skill issue with you. She is pissing me off today. Like, girl, do you got another cigarette? You got another one? I could really use a cig right now. <laughs> Make matters worse, our man in here making it rain on other women. This is the worst day of my life. Y'all see him, he just watching. Ugh, Vlad. Benny, just try to make a move with him or something. I just don't know. At this point, we're begging him. This has been some grand reopening, like, I'm just glad Ben and Julia can relieve some stress. Um, hello? Sir? What is he doing under my blanket? Please. Y'all, I'm going to just show y'all a still image. This how y'all know Caleb was going crazy. All right, no more of this. No more. Let's go take this pregnancy test. I'm really, really hoping we have a kid. I've been wanting one for the past few episodes, honestly. The universe give me a kid right now. I won't drink. I won't smoke. I won't kiss no man. I will not even vape. Please. Just give me a child. That's all that I want. Oh. You know what? Regarding everything I just said, I might still do half of those things. I'm gonna keep it so real. I'm gonna I'm do half of those things still, but thank you, universe. See you in hell, bitch. Girl, who? Oh, shit, me. Oh, Grace, girl. Let me tell you one thing about my series, okay? You will never win against the main character. Look, walk it off, Benadrilia, right? Rightfully so, she ain't even phased. She ain't even phase. She opening up Social Bunny right now. Made a post talking about this hoe just tried it. <laughs> now Grace is about to get tragic, but not for me. Uh-uh, uh-uh, don't get to running. You stay right there. Oh damn, okay, I didn't even have to tell her to do it. And it's nothing personal, Grace. Like, it's really nothing personal, but like, you just tried to stun on me and make me look stupid in front of everybody. And you call me a bitch. <laughs> like, obviously we was gonna have to get our lick back. Let it be known to anybody else that wants to try it. Trust. Trust. You will be dealt with. Mm hmm Don, I know you hear this sink. Like, bruh. Do better, ma. Damn. Yo, I'm about to go back on my word. I feel like if we having this baby with Caleb, he needs to be in the baby's life. I'm gonna try my hardest to make it official between them. Possibly marriage, possibly moving in. I might steal his social security. Well, this is a sight. You got Saucy Santana, Audrina, and then Greg. And Caleb with his lovely girlfriend, Roger the Alien. All right, let me go ahead and pin this picture on my wall. Good sis, post lick. <laughs> I know that's right. You see how we posted up? Like this my bestie, like he he he, ka ka ka. <laughs> No, psych. We wasn't no twin them. Nah, we never was. And now we never will be. All right, y'all. They finna have their quote unquote first kiss. But I know her and her mans. They be kissing all the time. They just got it in upstairs. You better say yes when I ask him to be our boyfriend. Because if he don't, y'all, the way I'm going to flip out, y'all would think I'm a gymnast. Oh, he's singing to us. Oh, wait. Oh, is that Grim? <laughs> what is he doing here? You know what? Enjoy your stay. Y'all, he said yes. They doing the whole picture shenanigans. How cute. Why he eating me up, though? Why the fuck is this nigga eating me up right now? Mm. I'm a little embarrassed. You really think I'm going to put that on Simstagram? Hell no, nah, I'm not posting that picture. My sicker eating me up in the picture? Hell nah. Anyway, I'm having them die for thrills because apparently we need more romance to get married. The dumpster is my favorite woohoo spot. What is Adderall Isha doing out here, though? In the rain? Girl, why are you just watching them? And she like real life snooping, y'all. She trying to like look under the lid and all. 
She ain't even, <laughs> she's not even hiding it. Weird ass. Oh my goodness. Adderall Leash about to get hit with a lightning bolt. Oh my gosh. What is going on over here? Girl, what was that? Why'd you just beat that girl up and then act like nothing happened? Let me just mind mine. Well, damn. If they ain't have enough romance before, they certainly have enough now. Damn, that must hurt like on the concrete, y'all. Can we propose now? Oh my gosh, you're still not high enough. Okay, just be enticing. Girl, stop running away. It is just rain. Damn, this rain got my cigarette tweaking. Hold on, he good? Just kiss his cheek. We about to just bombard him right now. Sir, why are you looking at Adoralisha like that? Don't try it. Since you want to snoop so bad, watch this. Yeah, and your umbrella broke. Karma, bitch. And you can try all you want to, but my man, he know where home is. Oh, she is so bitter right now. Finally. My goodness. It's taking forever. We finna propose, y'all. Oh my gosh. I thought I'd never see the day. Honestly, I thought I was gonna dump this man earlier in the episode, but I changed my mind. So, what's next? I wanna go to Barbados. Oh, he wanna take a picture? This is so cute. I mean, it's mad dark outside, but this is so cute. We're just gonna put a filter on it. Maybe we could just shrink this nose a little bit. I don't know. See, yeah, the lighting is way better in here. Oh, they're so cute. Once again, he's eating us up, but we just gonna spam this. It's okay. Okay, we just gotta frame it. Oh, her Prince Charming. I wanna upload this to Simstagram. This is too cute. There's a couple pictures I wanna upload, actually. I think, oh, let's upload the one downstairs. Y'all, I'm about to break the timeline with this picture. Especially when I upload this one right after, yes. Do a Benny. We need to buy like some Zaw off of him. Oh my gosh, my debt. <laughs> Y'all, cause he said something was gonna happen to me if I didn't pay him back in five days. And I think we on day four. Do y'all think my fiance would kidnap me? I'm glad I'm paying it back. Y'all, the bodega got struck with a lightning bolt. I just bought this sign, bruh. Okay, I'm gonna do it later. I can't. All right, no more games, y'all. Benadrillia needs to be a bride right now. Elope immediately. Right here in front of the bodega. Actually, that's how it should be. This is iconic, actually. Y'all know it's real love when y'all can get married the same day y'all started dating. Right in front of this man. He's like the efficient. Is that the girl that was trying to fix my cable? I feel like I've seen her before. Anyway, wait, hold on. Where's the efficient going? Y'all, this is the longest wedding of my life. I see why the efficient left. It's been like five minutes. Just put the damn rings on. Y'all, there are still no rings in sight. Y'all, who the fuck? <laughs> I know that's not Mother Melinda. Girl, who are you fighting right now? Bro, not on my wedding day, bro. This is so ghetto. I'm actually pissed off. Ooh. Oh, y'all, we need to wrap this up. Y'all, just exchange the rings for real. I feel like somebody is gonna die if we out here any longer. Exhibit A, like, Lilith got struck by lightning. Y'all, please. <laughs> Do y'all hear the way they are, like, real life scrapping? Oh, my goodness. Y'all, just put the rings on. Oh, she won and did. As she should. Benny's booty bodega in this bitch. Oh, uh, uh, all right. Wrap this ghetto ass wedding up. Now y'all pissing me off. I'm about to get real angry and upset. Girl, you better get the fuck. Move. My goodness. I'm about to like explode. I'm so pissed off. All right, finally. You can move in with us, but really, I don't want your sister in my household. No, thank you. And I don't need your money. I'm independent. Girl, Melinda, you better win. And she lost. Oh my gosh, we just taking L's off. Oh, hold on. She said, hold up, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished? My good sister said, best two out of three, bitch. Wait, hold on. Oh, I thought Bethany was about to jump. <laughs> I thought Bethany was about to jump in for a second. Oh my gosh. What the Melinda about to be on life support? Oh my gosh, and we lost. Wow. Girl, you initiated two of the fights and lost two. That is so embarrassing. All right, y'all, two things. One, I gave Caleb a makeover. Two, I accidentally deleted Dusty from the family. But he will be back. Like, trust, he will be back. I promise. This night's been going good. How much have we made tonight? Oh, speaking of, how much? 491? Nah, I don't think that's right. I think it got messed up because we went into creative sim. Because I know, 
I know we made way more than that. Don't play me. I don't know, y'all. Maybe Caleb need to go back to the club because I can't even play with him. He keep on dancing. Like, please. Oh, my gosh. Why the, <laughs> Why the Adderall Alicia just slap Audrina like that? What did I miss? Where have I been? Because that was just out of nowhere. I don't even think Audrina knows what the beef is. Like... Either that or like, I don't know, maybe their throuple didn't work out. My man, my man, my man. They're so, girl, put his big ass grow ass down. Oh my gosh, just give him my man, my man. Like, oh my gosh. At least save this for the bedroom. Like, why are y'all doing this in the middle of the club right now? Like, please. Oh, it's Brittany. Oh, hi, Brittany. What is Melinda saying? Try going to the gym. Maybe that will calm you down. Girl, do not try it today. It's not the day. You worried about me, but like, evidently, you could hardly stand up. Mind your business. Steve. Sawato. Obima. Seneca Melinda Brittany I had to do it to him. I, I give these girls so many opportunities for real. Oh my goodness. Y'all, why are we letting Adoralisha repair the fridge with a puddle next to it? Like, we learned from this. I'm gonna try to distract her real quick. I can't have another sim go out this way. I just can't. Adrena, I just want to apologize on Adoralisha's behalf. I don't know what got into her, but you just... You can't eat a meal. Because why did she just go off on Benadrilia, but we defending her right now? This is what I'm talking about. Same old mother Melinda. She about to get it. I'm tired of these girls disrespecting me. <gasps> Audrina. She just like broke her back. Girl, don't ask nothing about no workers comp because this is not even a legal business. I don't know. I feel like the beef between Benadrilia and Melinda, like, it's forever beef. Like, we gonna keep going back and forth. <laughs> about to drag her in a second. She don't even know what's coming. <gasps> no! Melinda, my baby! Why would she do that? Why would she do that? Oh my gosh. No! My heart is so broken right now. Y'all, we was just literally diagnosed with pregnancy. She really took it there, and there was no reason to. There was no reason. We didn't even make it to the second trimester. Whoa. Am I tweaking, or was Adoralisha just all over my man right now? No, because this bitch is really trying to steal my man right now. Adoralisha, are you serious, Ma? After we literally just lost our baby? You guys. She... <gasps> oh, she really just stole my man. Oh, Benadrilia, girl. This is not the day for you. <gasps> they taking pictures and everything. We did that. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Y'all, I'm about to shut down the shop. This is terrible. We just got married today. Oh, my gosh. And he already cheated on me so bad with a boofy doop. A boofy ass, a jealous, wannabe Benadrillia. I can't. I'm like actually sick. You guys, I wasn't recording, but Benadrillia just bust out the Glock and shot Mother Melinda. And, and why is Caleb going off on me right now? Like, please, let a sister breathe. Violence is never the answer. Cheating is never the answer. How about that? Now check that. You guys... I think that's it for today. Like, let's just call it a night. 